Story. I'm feeling really shitty today. Some people were like, I'm so sorry. Drinks a cup of water. Take a walk outside your house. Have some ice cream. They had ice cream. So I got my jacket and went off. Have this. Because he hugged me <laughs> when I need love. Growing up, my dad always felt that skirts below Didi made you look lazy. I wouldn't say that anymore because I thought this was a really good buy for one pound. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. My name is Stephanie and I'm a London based content creator. This video is going to be the finds I got from a recently discovered thrift shop very close to my house. The other day I was feeling very down, very out of it. I actually put it on my Insta story. I'm feeling really shitty today. And lots of people were like, oh my god, I'm so sorry. Drink a cup of water, take a walk outside your house, have some ice cream. Yes, I actually had ice cream and felt very good about it. Then again, I was like, no, let me actually take a walk around the area and find out what's up with this area. I always go out to post stuff, but I get driven by hobby. I've never really gone out myself to look around like what's really happening here. Before I left the house, I even said, okay, I needed a blazer in my life. I've always been complaining I didn't have a black blazer. That was in my mind. I wanted a hat as well. Well, you know these wide brim structured hats that don't flap up and down the whole place i need something like that but i haven't been able to find something that will shoot me well and then what else was i think is there anything for work really I got my jacket got on the bus and went off even go and print out the paper and then went to post office did my posting and i said exploring so i found this place um, it was called alice Hospice, something like that. I'm going to put a picture on the screen and I walked in something it wasn't that big like other thrift shops I'll go and get impressed with but guys the things I found here were really really lovely I walked into the shop it was pretty the music was very English it was kind of boring the clothing inside were hung really organized hung in like different sections obviously jackets blazers trousers shirts skirts and then shoes and bags at some point yeah I saw bags as well but I wasn't impressed with the bags so guys I'm just looking around and then these were the things I found so let's start from number one which is the place the first thing I did was to go to the male section, just find a blazer that would have long sleeves, which is what I really love, and then just be a bit loose on me. So I got this one. I think if I'd gone a bit lower in size with this one, yeah, it would be perfect, but it's a thrift shop, so you can't be asking them for a lower size. And yeah, I just thought I would I'll grab this because it hug me <laughs> when I need love. So I got this for yeah, the tag is still there, just so I'll convince you guys that the prices are really good. Four pounds, guys, four pounds. I got this blazer and then it's it's a brand actually. Oh dear. I can't say the brand name, but if I can find it when I take it off, I'll put it on the screen now. And the next thing I got was this skirt. I was impressed with this skirt because I knew I did not have a knee length skirt that was just simple. Most of my skirts are above the knee because very you know, my dad always felt that skirts below the knee made you look lazy. I wouldn't say that anymore because obviously we have like this midi skirts that are straight and that are so classy. It was a 12. Ideally I wear a 10 but it doesn't matter when things don't fit you you know to the teeth. It's a brand called Laura Clement. So I guess it's an English brand. Then this was three pounds. It was in a good condition. You have to look at these three store things. Just make sure there's no error somewhere or it's not like too used and things like that. Next I got was this pair of leather pants. This is a very moda piece 32 which is the waist which would be okay for me to be honest. I wear a 30-32 on the waist so that was fine. So the fact that it was long enough. But that's always my problem with pants not being long enough. I have leather or full leather but it's leggings fabric. I even got one recently sent to me from Femlo. It's the same leggings-ish kind of thing but this is actually like trouser fabric which made me really excited and happy. So this is basically uh, my first pair of leather pants. This was three pounds. Next, I got this pair of shorts. The reason I got this pair of shorts is because I'm trying to do a shoot. The next shoot I want to do, my photographer is going to be a co odd shoot. So I just thought I'll get this with my burgundy blazer. I'm going to style it when I'm styling all these pieces um, right now for you guys. But yeah, I thought, you know, I'll get this just for that. And guess what, guys? This was actually one pound. I just saw it in one pound section. Like, okay, let's just find the neatest thing here. The belt holes are still very good. The, the stretch of the waist is beautiful. The stripes, lovely. The fabric, lovely. Everything is still very neat. There's no thread running anywhere. So yeah, I thought this was a really good buy for one pound. Ha! Next was a top man jumper. I don't know, it's just simple. It's different, two different colors. This is not even black. This is like dark green, very, very dark green. And then this is grayish. Love the way it's two toned. I love the way the fact that the sleeves are long enough to be folded up and just look, you know, effortlessly cool with. 
I got this um, for five pounds guys and I got it in a large I really love this I'm going to definitely wear this on the first week I resume work I'm sure that's it for oh then the shoes oh my god i'm even wearing them now the shoes i got from there guys you know when your feet is big like even going to regular stores <laughs> on the high street or luxury stores it's always long to find an eight just happily sitting down somewhere when i got there i just found this guys in a 42 and i was like oh my lord this is actually mine i know my friend ada she loves shoes like this it's just so comfortable guys like you just wear it you can wear it to work easily and you're looking beautifully chic look at the heels not too high a lot of my high heels i only use them for shoes look at the leather and then the brand is jones boots makers guys i was so impressed with this it was seven pounds i think this was like one of the expensive things i got but it was totally worth it my boots i had used from when i was in Leeds in 2010 to last year valentine's day when my husband replaced them with jones boot makers they are amazing with the quality and I, I wear this in like every winter and I'm so excited to have gotten this pair of black heels and obviously black like you can wear with anything next thing I got was this I just thought it was funny just put at our door we didn't have a wreath in Christmas or anything like that and our door is just boring the footman doesn't say anything so I just thought this would be nice go away come back with some champagne yeah so when you come visit us and you don't bring champagne go back <laughs> this, this was the next thing I got guys. I love earrings like this things that just sit on your ear and I'm very classy And then this was gold and um, this little pearl thing I just thought it would go with anything especially with my look cut things like this pop out really really nicely. Yeah Yeah, so I got these for three pounds last but not the list. I got this um, I really got this because I thought my husband would like it I haven't even shown him to ask him if he likes it But I know he likes all these kind of African things So I just thought we could put it on the shelf over there Yeah, you just add to the house Yeah, I got this for 2 I got the, the dot thing for 2 50 as well I tried to style all these pieces just amongst each other So I don't get any other extra piece The only extra piece I got was my burgundy blazer So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video I made to style my pieces Thank you guys for this video i hope you enjoyed it i hope it wasn't too long enough if this is your first time on my channel thank you so much for watching to this point please click the subscribe button and join my family everybody should just click the thumb up button because it helps the movement of my videos all around youtube space and drop a comment because i really love to read from you see you guys on the next episode Bye bye